Hello friends and welcome to another tutorial on Geeks for Geeks. In this video, we are going to understand the program which checks whether a given floating point number is an even or odd. First, let us understand the problem statement. We can check whether an integer is even or odd by dividing its last digit by 2. But in case of a floating point number, we can't check a number is even or odd by just dividing its last digit by 2. For example, 100.70 is an odd number but its last digit is divisible by 2. So let us see the approach. We start traversing a number from its LSB until we get a non-zero digit or a period. If the number is divisible by 2, it is even, else odd. If it is a dot, then it means decimal part of number is traversed and now we can check number is even or odd by dividing the number by 2 whether it is 0 or non-zero digit. Next, let us see the algorithm. We take a sample floating point number 100.70 in string format and pass it to is even function. Now, in the isEven function, we take an integer L which will be equal to s dot length, that is 6 for our case. Then, we take a dot scene boolean variable initialized to false and traverse from L minus 1 to 0 in the for loop. So, first i will be 5. s of 5 is 0. Next, we check if s of i is 0 and dot scene is false in the first if condition. As both are true, the first if condition gets satisfied and we continue iteration in the for loop. So, i will be now 4. s of 4 is 7. Since s of 4 is not 0, the first if condition does not get satisfied and we go to the second if statement and check if s of i is a dot. As it is not, we go to the third if statement and check if the integral of s of i is divisible by 2. As 7 mod of 2 is not 0, the if condition does not get satisfied and we return false. So this floating point number is odd. With this, we come to an end of this tutorial. For any doubts or suggestions, please leave them in the comment section below. Thank you for watching.